Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to show you how to set the time and the brew later on this Black & Decker 12-pot programmable coffee maker. Model number CM1331BS. This is brand new, just came out. Um, I got mine at Walmart. Check out my other videos. I'm going, to, I'm going to be doing a detailed review on this and also a cleaning, how to clean the coffee maker. But this video is just going to concentrate on setting the clock and setting the brew later. So first off, this thing has a really nice display. This is one of the nicer coffee maker displays I like. The LEDs, it's kind of like backlit all the time. Or not backlit, but they're just, they show up all the time. And it's a really nice display. So unfortunately with most coffee makers, when you lose power for more than 5 or 10 seconds, you're gonna, it's going to display, it's going to flash 12, you're going to lose your brew later time and everything. So... Let me first start off, so we're going to set the time first. And it's got this hour and minute button right here. And there's only a PM light. So we're going to come up here and just simply start pressing the hour buttons. So be careful. If you ever bump these buttons, it will change the time on you. So with there only being a PM light, there is no AM light. So right now it's 11 AM. And if I want to change the minutes... There's how we change the minutes, 11.05 a.m. Now, the brew later is that, this is one of the easiest ones I've ever come across. You're just gonna simply press the brew later button, and now you add, it changed it to 12. Now you're gonna change the time of when you want it to brew. So most people want a cup of coffee in the a.m. So make sure the p.m. light's not lit. So let's do five a.m., let's do minutes, let's do 5.10. You're going to want to give this coffee maker about 20 minutes, maybe 10, 15 minutes to brew the cup of coffee before you're ready. Now, what's nice about this is, see how that just changed back to time and it left that light lit. If that light is lit, that means this will start at that time you programmed. And it's really simple to check the time. Just come up here and hit the button. Okay, yeah. It's going to start at 5.10. After three seconds, it's going to revert back. This is normal time, but it leaves that light on. So make sure you got your water and coffee in, and this, this coffee maker will start at 11, 10 a.m. in the morning. So this is a really nice coffee maker as far as simplicity. Now there is one thing. So if you want to turn, so say you change your mind, oh, I want to sleep in. I don't want the coffee maker to start in the morning. So you have to kind of like do a trick. You have to like, this is the normal brew button, and then turn it off real quick. That deactivates the brew, brew later light. That's the only way of deactivating it. So again, we've got our time set. If we want to do a brew later, we're going to come up here and hit the brew later button. We can add our, we can change our time. Make sure the the AM lights, you know, the PM lights not lit if you want AM. And then after three seconds, it just automatically turns on the brew later. That's a that's a, this is like I said, one of the nicest ones I've seen. Now. And if we want to cancel, we got to press this button and turn it off real quick. Now, if you want to just uh, brew a pot of coffee, you just press that button. That starts the brew process. And then that's how you manually turn it off. And it's got a really nice, how it's backlit. And if you want that strong, that bold to start, you would press that and then do the brew later. And then in the morning, it would start your, it would do a strong uh, brew for the brew later. And again, if we want to cancel that, we just cancel it. And then some of the other features of this coffee maker is the, uh, the keep warm. So when I press that, it defaults to 120 minutes, but I can go off. What that is, is it won't keep the um, warming plate on. After it's done brewing its pot of coffee, This that keep warm is how long it does it keep, how long does it keep the warming plate on? So again, we can go off, if I press 30 minutes, 60 minutes, 90 minutes, or 120 minutes. This is a really nice feature so that you don't burn the um, coffee. Because if you leave that warming plate on for a very long time, it will evaporate the coffee out of there and, burn, and you'll get burnt coffee in your coffee pot. So again, this is just a dad. This was a really quick video on how to set the brew later. This is, looks like a really nice coffee maker can't wait to do my um, detailed review on it. If you could, please like and subscribe and thank you for watching.